it is Tuesday and it is going to be an interesting day. Baby girl is <laughs> right here, just hanging out. But um, at around 11, 11.30, 11 something-ish, I have to leave to go to um, my school for orientation. And they didn't really give a lot of details, so I probably won't get many details till I get there. So as of right now, I don't know how long I'm going to be gone which is kind of stressful, but people have, like, the option to stay overnight in the dorms, and I'm hoping they're not too frustrated or annoyed or whatever that I can't do that because I just can't, and it doesn't make sense anyway considering I'm living at home during the school year rather than on campus, so I don't know, but that'll be interesting. Hopefully it's not anything too crazy. I already have my schedule set up the way that I want it, so I don't really have to change anything with that. And then there's orientation tomorrow, too, and I'm hoping I just won't have to go to that because it seems like it's more, like, I don't know. It seems like it's more, like, optional type things. Like, there's financial aid appointments, which I don't need. Um, there's like, learning about life on campus and, like, living on campus. I don't know. Just things like that. So maybe I won't have to go tomorrow, but I'm not exactly sure. Hi, boys. Hey, excuse me. Is that my phone? <laughs> but I guess I should get up. And, I mean, I don't really have to start getting ready yet. It's only, like, 7. Ooh, but, you know. Hey, boobus. Please just don't wrap that cord around your neck. That would not be good. Yeah. Yeah, okay. We are in our usual rug hangout spot because, I don't know, it's comfy for one and I'm stressed out for two, so I just need to... So, but I had orientation, or part of orientation today, and all I'm going to say is, it's kind of what I expect, like, a preschool orientation to be, or, like, just a normal day at preschool. That's what it felt like. So, it was kind of pathetic, and it was kind of a waste of my day, and I really didn't learn anything useful from it, so it's really frustrating. <laughs> Because I was away from Annabelle that whole time and it just, it wasn't worth my time. I have to go back tomorrow and it's only for like half an hour. I mean, there's other things that they want us to do, but they're just, it's not worth it. It's all f fun and games and it's just not my thing. It's not what I want to spend my time doing, especially when I have Annabelle here. So... I have an academic advising appointment tomorrow at like 8.15, so I'll go to that, and then I'll be back after that because I'm not doing anything else. Heck, heck no. I won't be with my babies. Yeah. But I feel like orientation is supposed to get you excited for college, and it kind of did the opposite for me. Can you say mama? You have to say mama. Say mama. Okay. Say, if you say okay, you have to say mama. 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 Can I kiss? Say mama. 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 Happy baby. Happy baby. Happy baby. Happy baby. Happy baby. Happy baby.
Happy baby. Yeah. How is your guys' Oh no. Annabelle's up from her nap and getting her diaper changed. Well, it's already changed, but I look cute. And she's wearing this little romper that I made. But this is the three to six month size. Um, there's still quite a bit of space where this can go back. These are a little long on her still and they're crossed in the back. So, you can uncross them to make them even longer. And so, someone that's even bigger than Annabelle is would be able to wear this. Um, I figured Annabelle's probably on, like, the smaller side of the three to six month size. Um, so, I was happy to see that this fit the way that it did on her. Because, how much do you weigh? What, 15 pounds? 14, 13, I don't know. She doesn't weigh very much compared to the typical, like, six, seven month, month old. So, I'm assuming that this would be good for three to six month size, considering she fits in it, um, considering it's still pretty big on her and she's pretty little. It's just so hard because I th think about it and I'm like, oh, she's seven months old. This would be a six to nine month size. And it's like, no, she's not typical seven month old size. She's typical like three, four month old size. So that's how we figured that out. But I figured out the sizing based on um, Carter's onesies. So I used like the length from the shoulder to the crotch from those and then just made it a little bit longer because they are supposed to be a little bit baggy, not so tight. So. I'm hoping that it'll work out just fine, but like I said, they will be custom ordered, so if you need me to modify a size at all, I'm sure I can do that. Anyway, back to life. I had to go to the other part of orientation today, which was an advising, academic advising session that was supposed to be 15 to 20 minutes or 20 to 30 minutes, I don't know, but it ended up being more like an hour to like get in and out of there, so that was extremely frustrating because I was hoping to be back before Annabelle woke up from her morning nap and not even close. <sighs> Bobby, so I'm stressed out. I'm stressed out. Can I have a kiss? Can I have a kiss? Hey, hey, Pokeballs, can I have a kiss, please? Can I have a kiss? Kiss? No? Okay. Fine. Excuse me! I can guarantee you for the rest of the evening they're gonna wanna run straight back to that spot. <laughs> oh yeah, for sure. Maybe not after all these baths. Hi, sad puppy. Did you roll in the mud? Oh my jeez. Oh. Yeah, maybe. Oh my jeez. Say, oh my jeez, Bobby. This little girl has been so fussy, and I've had no idea why. So I've just been continuously trying to get her to calm down and it's kind of been a struggle but she's basically she's not asleep but she's almost asleep right now so 
this is going to be at the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you're having a good day or a good night wherever you are, whenever you're watching.